In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a run chart, which is also known as a time plot or sometimes even called the time series plot. So really we're interested in plotting data over time. You can see that I already have my data set loaded into MATLAB. It's called miles. And one of the things I want to point out with my data set is the data is already arranged in order by year and then by month. And then we have our data, which is the million miles area right here. In order to create the graphic that we want, we're simply going to use the, the plot function. And you can see with the plot function, I'm going to put my data set dot the variable I'm using. So I'm using that million miles variable. And then I'm changing the color. I'm, the color is going to be K, which I believe is black. And then we can choose our marker that we're going to represent each of the points with. You can use pretty much anything you want, but you have to call the marker argument. And then afterwards, you have to define what marker you're using. And so in this case, I'm using the, the period after this. And then the other things that we should include on here are labels for this pop plot. For the X label, you can see we're going to use months from January 1964 to December of 1970. So this will show up as our X label. For the Y label, we're going to label that millions of passenger miles. And for the title, we're going to title the graph time plot for passenger airline miles in the United Kingdom. So when we go ahead and run this, this will generate our output. And you can see when you generate this, we get the time plot with the title, the label for the X axis and the Y axis, and then we get our time series graphic. Um, so this is how you create a really simple time series plot or time plot or run chart, whatever you want to call it. Um, a couple things that you may want to look for are trends, uh, patterns, um, and certainly there's, there's other things that are going on in here, and it really depends on what the application is uh, that you're using this for. So hopefully this gives you enough information to start creating a basic time series plot. And then uh, certainly you can look up help on the MATLAB help area to figure out what other arguments there are available in here to help you um, create a much uh, ro more robust graphic.